The last days of 2020 and the beginning of 2021, while the people of Tween Wen District, a large district located at the northern gateway of Haiphong City, are rushing to complete the last work of the old year, a new year is very much. Negative impact of the COVID-19 pandemic to enter a new year with much hope of returning to normal life. When the epidemic was gradually controlled, in the midst of that, in some areas of Tween Wen District, there were consecutive incidents of intentional injury, theft, robbery of property with weapons, causing confusion in public opinion and seriously affecting the security and order situation in the locality, making it difficult for pressure to surround the forces. Haiphong City Police, the days before the Lunar New Year. At dawn on November 29, 2020, the police of Tween Wen District received a report from the police of Tui Duong Commune about the late night of November 28, 2020 at a furniture business in the village of Tui Duong Commune, Tween Wen District, being attacked by a fire. The subject broke into and stole property, used a knife to attack the homeowner when discovered. Immediately after receiving the news, Tween Wen District Police were present at the place of the incident to check the scene to collect traces and gathering information from the victim, the reason for the dark night plus the sudden attack, the panic, so the victim can hardly provide any information related to the identity or identity of the perpetrator, after the police agency of Tween Wen District is conducting an investigation, reviewing and verifying to collect more information from people living around the scene to clarify the case, then on January 5th, 2021, there was information that the Prudential Insurance Office in New Ideo Town, Tween Wen District, was broken into the safe and took up to nearly 450 million VND, at the time of the incident. The incident was late at night on January 4th, there was no employee or security guard of the insurance office present. Therefore, recording information from people who knew the job was impossible, security camera system inside. The office was disabled during the time of the theft, the scene examination was carried out meticulously with the goal of finding traces of evidence related to the identity of the perpetrator, but the results were obtained. Was not as desired, in addition to determining the direction of the subject's entry and exit was in the same direction, the investigating agency could not collect any more valuable evidence to trace the crime, back on the scene of the incident has relatively similar characteristics, in the first case, which is the case of the timber trader, this subject also broke into the method at night and at dawn, few people passed through that area, the second was the method of breaking in, the object was using pliers to break into the window area, into the back openings of the house, then the subject went inside to continue to find valuable assets such as safes to use pliers and other tools. The tool brought with him broke into the safe and stole the property, the point that the investigative agency noticed was that at the insurance office there were many valuable electronic equipment assets but the subject did not touch it. Cash only, this detail helps the police agency to open up some useful comments such as the number of subjects involved in the case is not much, the perpetrator is definitely in need of a large amount of cash, otherwise this detail also causes difficulties. For the investigating agency in the process of finding evidence because this is also one of the investigative measures to help find the identity of the offender, synthesize the results of the scene examination, compare on many means and in both cases of breaking into a furniture business in Tui Duong Commune and the Prudential Insurance Office, the investigating agency found many similarities in terms of time frame, crime location, and method of breaking in. However, the investigation agency of Tween Wen District at this time does not have enough grounds to conclude that the culprit causing the above two thefts is the same object or by many different objects. One another problem that the police of Tween Wen District have to find answers, is that the offenders are locals or come from neighboring areas. Assigned by leaders focus on verifying all objects, subjects with criminal records, subjects without jobs, vagrants, playing games, all damaged objects in Tween Wen area, in parallel with the above task, the working group taking on the task of investigating, reviewing, and collecting the security camera system, was also actively involved, all camera heads on the roads in and out of the scene of the two incidents were collected by scouts observed, analyzed, and statistical results by day two. 
Report to District Police Leadership. Tween Wen has 35 very large communes and townships, through professional operations, but basically, all localities report back and screen the subjects and all communes have no symptoms of the subject. Any symptoms, are no longer in the locality, if the task group receiving the task of grasping the area has not yet established any object suspect related to the cases, the working group will review the cameras. After days of hard work and long sleepless nights have been zoned out and now only focus on a picture of two objects riding each other on red motorbikes branded Wavars appearing near the insurance office on the night of the day and night. January 4, 2011, when the first clues flashed, Tween Wen District Police received news on the night of January 14 and early morning, January 15, 2021, at Vidin Bank's transaction office. Tui District. The former city of Haifang was attacked by an intruder to protect and destroy the safe, consecutively organizing the information reported by the police of Tween Wen District to the head of the investigative police force. The police Haifang City's security was like a fire. Three cases of theft, robbery, intentional injury, occurred consecutively in less than two months. The time gap between the crimes was getting denser and denser especially the level of violence, the next time will increase more than the last time, so if there is one more day of outlaws, the subject will endanger people's property in life and negatively affect the situation. For the urgent situation, the head of the Haifang City Police Investigation Force decided to assign the Criminal Police Department to the Criminal Technical Department and Functional Units. Coordinated with Tween Wen Police to requisition all means of transport to apply the most modern investigative measures of the industry in the series of cases before the Tan SUU Lunar New Year, then the special investigation with secret number 121T was obtained. Established with the advice and also the order of the head of the special case committee, if you haven't solved the case, you haven't returned to the psychological agency of the Vietnamese people, I really respect and cherish the traditional Tet. There is a new year in a year, everyone wants to go home to celebrate Tet with some vibe. If I don't make this clear, it's really hard for my brothers and sisters to go to work on the project, try to solve the case first, so that we can be comfortable. And everyone is comfortable and we are determined. and many teams of seasoned detectives and investigators of the criminal police department along with the criminal technical department were directly present in Tween Wen district to observe the process of the scene examination carried out at 3 the location where a series of theft and robbery cases happened, the results of previous investigation, verification, review, and classification of objects by the Tween Wen district police were also gathered for the special project committee to study, analyze, and evaluate tries to give the next direction for solving the case, the only bright spot in the expression that occurred at Vidin Bank's transaction office is that there is a witness, this person is the office guard and also is the victim in the case, the victim's information provided when the subject was a man entering the bank from the back door, as soon as it was discovered that the subject had used an electric baton to attack the victim, using wire and tape wrapped in many places on the body to destroy the will of the victim. The subject used a variety of tools to break all the safes in the bank, then searched around the banks, the transaction room before leaving by the way in. Comparing the results of the scene examination with the victim's testimonies, the police agency found that they completely matched. The judgment of the police agency was that the object caused the crime. The case can have one or two names, but when breaking into, there is only one. The remaining subject is outside to listen and protect the object inside, the main subject is questioned by many banks through the ventilation box of the size 20 x 30 centimeters at the back of the house. After breaking into the interior, he broke the lock of many doors, disabled the camera system before attacking the guard to rob the property, in my mind began to form something. That assesses the rules of all three cases, summarizing, we see this, firstly, the perpetrator is very knowledgeable in the colony and understands the rules of business activities as well as is the owners, the second is that there is a choice you have in terms of time and location to break into, the third is the same form, when breaking in, you need to search the property and show a very strong calculation. 
active, ready to dominate and injure the owner as well as the guard. During the investigation of the scene inside, there was an umbrella with broken glass, it was only about 10 to 15 centimeters in size, and then we checked, let some brothers put their hands in it. When testing a person who is fat and fat, the hand cannot be retracted, we determine that the subject climbs very well, the body shape must be thin and the height of the subject is also good. On average, this subject is right-handed, the system of documents so far, the investigating agency determined that the perpetrator caused a series of thefts and robberies on the same group of subjects. The portrait of the offender was also initially erected as a basis for the review, then selected for later from 35 communes and towns in the territory of TH district. The committee of the Nguyen committee of the special project has been shortened and now only focuses on reviewing in the communes surrounding the scene of three cases, especially focusing on New Ideo town, Tui Duong commune and Hoa Bin commune. Review the entire population of young people in all three localities, especially focusing on those with a criminal record for property infringement, gambling addiction, financial hardship, young people who are not in the above categories but do not have a job, have a small shape, and are also paid special attention by the special project committee. Finally, a task that cannot be ignored is to make a list of individuals who are currently employed. Owner of a Red Wave R's vehicle with the above mentioned local household, only Tui Duong Commune, a key area for security and order of Tui Nguyen District, has 200 people with criminal records, not including drug addicts and other social evils, it is enough to understand that this is a blockade. The dense amount of work that the scouts of the 121T project had to go through, went from door to door, knocked from door to door, and unleashed all the scouting forces to find the target, going down to the area to check each village after village. Subject 1, all houses enter to monitor. The task force tracked the object through reviewing the security camera and simultaneously performed two tasks including analyzing data on the image of two objects riding together on motorbikes with the Red Wave R's brand appearing near the office. Prudential Insurance Department and late on January 4, 2021, were previously obtained, and continued to follow the moving direction of the objects to determine the beginning and the end of their appearance the object was riding a motorbike, we could identify the wave vehicle, but we could not determine the original number plate because of going at night or because of the backlight. Although we could not identify the license plate as well as the first point of the objects appeared, but the police agency captured the image of a red wave car turning and Dong Mat village, Tui Duong commune. This helps to strengthen the investigation committee's belief that the perpetrator of the incident is hiding somewhere in Tui Duong commune, along with the results of verification checks on the investigative agency. Go one step further by collecting narrow the scope of investigation and verification, focusing more on cool rural villages. The results of the review and verification in Dong Mat village showed that the number of subjects with a history of criminal history and smoking addiction all had alibi, the subjects involved in other evils had a physique that was completely opposite to the assessment of the investigating agency, especially, none of these people owned a red wear car, someone who owned a car similar to the sea ward appeared at the scene, but there was no word of it, even had a job. Stabilized, the results of the investigation were like a mess, confusing even the most senior people in the investigating police force, but when I came to my senses, there were many similarities between the subject of the crime and the police. Citizen of Hung Long Island, whose physique is consistent with the assessment of the police agency. The subject of the crime Hung Long Island was born in 1989 with a permanent residence in Dong Mat Village, Tui Huang Commune, Tui Nguyen District, Haiphong City, and was put in the sights of the project committee. The results of in-depth verification showed that Long was born in a basic family, has a wife and two children, has a stable job at a facility specializing in designing and installing billboards located in Tui Nguyen District. Kiu Long is gifted with many sports but the most prominent are soccer and martial arts. Subject Long does not play but is known to have no money and also has a loan from the bank. 
Subject is a game player and has a bank debt, in addition to having a loan. After verifying the relationships around, commented that Long had a lot of debt around his neighbor, also verified that Long had a relationship with the Hung Long digging object, it showed that recently. Here, Long often goes back and forth with Pham Kwok Hui, a high school classmate in Hoa Bin Commune, Tween Wen District. This information made the project committee immediately think of the image broadcast from the security camera recording the scene of the two subjects. Appeared at one of the three crime scenes, we built two objects, Long and Hui, who were the number one suspect for us to focus on investigating, launching all experienced scouts. Then mobilize the good people around to provide information, especially those that manifest ignorance and finance, and then those that show the movement rules of the subject. During the time of the case, one more document that led the investigating agency to believe that Deo Hung Long was involved in the case was after January 4, 2021 i.e. after the Prudential Insurance Department when thieves broke into and stole money, Long had money to cover some previous loans. The system analyzed the investigation and reconnaissance documents up to this point. The investigative agency had grounds to believe that Hung Long is the main subject of a series of theft and robbery. Cases in Tween Wen District Long is a stubborn object, has no criminal record and also very little to reveal that can be discovered by ordinary people, provided to the police force.